Preparation The new Flexway sliding system can be installed in almost any mould assembly with a minimum of effort and is designed for multiple use. For this, the fastening bolts between Flexway and tamper head are to be loosened and the fastening set removed. The Flexway unit is lifted from the tamper head A on the appropriate lifting point by a forklift and is set down on another tamper head B. Centering bolts on the tamper head ensure easy alignment of the Flexway unit. The connecting bolts are then reinserted and tightened. Changeover times are kept to a minimum thanks to the fast and easy replacement of the Flexway unit on tamper heads. The mounting of the Flexway unit on different tamper heads takes place away from the block production line and therefore does not interfere with the production process. Care must be taken to apply the correct locking torque when tightening the connecting bolts. The appropriate torque values can be found in the operating manual. Installation The mould assembly is now fully prepared for use and can be installed conventionally in the block production line in accordance with the machine manufacturer's instructions. The only remaining step is the connection of the compressed air feed line. It is not necessary to shake down the tamper head assembly after installation of the mould in the block production line. Production process The production process for the block production line remains unchanged. During each production cycle the horizontal movements of the tamper head are smoothly synchronized with the mould bottom. This ensures that the tamper shoes can move unbraced within the mould cavity and that no press capacities occur between the mould cavities and the sides of the tamper shoes. The flexway is controlled by the pneumatic control unit, which applies or releases the pneumatic braking function. The brake is released as soon as the tamper shoes are lowered into the mould cavities. After final compaction, the brake is closed to prevent any horizontal movement of the tamper shoes during demolding process. As the current position of the tamper shoes in the mould cavity is saved to each cycle, the tamper shoes remain precisely centred and without contact in the mould cavity for each subsequent cycle. The tamper shoes can move slightly in the horizontal during the main vibration sequence. This smooth horizontal sliding motion of the tamper shoes on the block surface improves the surface quality. The activation point for this motion is defined by the parameters set in the SPC control. It can be seen that the production with flexway function is active and, simultaneously, that a preset parameter value for the brake release point has been set. Product Quality Assurance a subsequently taken sample of the freshly pressed product immediately shows measurable improvements. Here, for example, an improvement of the face mix and the base mix density are easily recognizable. As a result, each block has a higher overall mass that, in turn, increases the block's strength and stability. Application Flexway is not only suitable for the production of rectangular blocks, but can also be used for the entire range of paver products. From paving blocks and paving slabs to large sized slabs. The Flexway can also be installed on top of mould assemblies featuring additional accessories. For instance, multi-level tamper heads or tamper heads with charging equalization. Benefits Flexway means improved quality in your block production processes, improved cycle performance thanks to reduced wear on mould components and increases productivity by the reduction in the proportion of rejects.